Question, the member from the Lakeford. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. My question is to the Attorney General. Uh, last fall, our government undertook to fix the Ontario Municipal Board and Land Use Planning System. Mr. Speaker, the government held a series of town halls and stakeholder meetings across the province to hear from Ontarians directly, and I held two town halls in my own riding of Etobicoke Lakeshore. Speaker, I can tell you from listening to my own constituents' concerns and from my 17 years' experience on City Council, the status quo is not working. Substantial changes to the land use planning system need to put people and communities first. And I was extremely pleased to hear the news that our government is taking action to overhaul the province's land use planning appeal system. More importantly, giving communities a stronger voice and ensuring people have access to faster, fairer, and more affordable hearings. Can the Attorney General tell us how community consultations helped inform the government's proposed actions? Thank you. Attorney General. Well, thank you very much, uh, Speaker. And I do want to truly, uh, really thank the member from Etobicoke Lecture Fuss for his, uh, his guidance uh, to both myself and to the Minister of Municipal Affairs on this very important issue. Being a planner himself, having served on the city, uh, Toronto uh, City Council, of course, he brought forward a lot of practical experience that was very helpful to us. So thanks to the member for his hard work on behalf of his community and advice to us. Speaker, we did some extensive consultation on, on this issue, as you, as you know. Uh, we held town halls with over 700 attendees from Windsor to Ottawa. Virtually every sector we heard from had ideas for improving the Ontario Municipal Board or the OMB um, and the hearing process. At the end of the day, Speaker, people want more community involvement and more local control over planning decisions. Speaker, in coming weeks, we will introduce legislation to transform Ontario's land use planning appeal yes, system, including uh, creating the local planning appeal tribunal, which would, if passed, replace the Ontario Thank Municipal you. Board and eliminating land fee and cost of hearings. Thank you. Supplementary. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and I want to thank the Attorney General for his answer. I'm very proud today that our government is committed to giving communities here, here. a stronger voice and create a more level playing field. I know my constituents are extremely pleased uh, by this commitment to overhaul the planning system. Mr. Speaker, the chief planner of the City of Toronto, Jennifer Keysmat, has called our government's reforms a generational change. Here, here. Toronto City Councillor uh, Josh Matlow has said government should be commended for finally tipping the balance of power away from developers and towards residents and municipal governments. This is how we plan communities. Speaker, the government is committed as part of its proposed legislation to establish a support centre to help citizens participate in the tribunal process. Question. Could the Attorney General tell us more about the local planning appeal support centre? Thank you, Attorney General. Speaker, as I was, I was uh, saying, uh, we will be creating a local planning appeal tribunal that will rep uh, replace the OMB. We also will be eliminating lengthy and costly de novo, uh, de novo hearings, and we'll be establishing an independent support centre uh, called the local planning appeal support center to provide free legal support for citizens participating in the tribunal processes this will spe uh, speak uh, uh, speaker will support more clear and more timely decision making in the end of the day speaker the result is going to be fewer shorter less costly hearings and more efficient decision making process giving communities a stronger voice and fostering a more level playing field that is why speaker mayors across yes, this sir. province residents across this province are supporting our, our, our proposal uh, it's been uh, described as a bold step that the province is taking speaker i'm hoping uh, that we'll bring this legislation Thank and that you. will be approved by this legislature thank you